pro tips for Perez, it's Tanel. We are going to do a bit of a bathroom addition this evening. Uh, getting to it a little bit late because I was cleaning all day in order to do this, putting things away and organizing as such. So I'm going to take you around my bathroom and the reasons that why I've done some things being a uh, para. I'm uh, going to flip the camera around so you got a little bit of better quality image going on. Thanks for watching. Coming into my bathroom. A tub shower combo with a shower bench. I had one custom done with no feet on the outside so that it didn't catch hair and was easier to clean. They both rest inside the tub. And then I have my back to it, a wand that comes down. I tuck it behind. I can transfer from the toilet to the bench, which is great. Shower caddies are absolutely key Help keep everything contained. Stick one at my level on the wall. Just a couple of suction cups from the hardware. Super accessible. Just regular vanity top. This mirror attached to the wall here at my height so I can tilt it down, do makeup. The mirror attached by a wire over top of the existing one that was already there so that you can see your face finally. My chin, my everything, which is great. We have a little basket on top of the toilet. It's got rubber gloves, key, paralyzed, hidden nicely because I don't like all the medical devices. We've got all the towel hooks in here, our plumbing flanges and piping. It's okay to be different. The shelf I can't reach. The one I can. No super crazy medical stuff. Toilet paper holder, almost out, uh oh. Catheters in my umbrella holder. That's key. And the wet wipes. Sneakily hidden inside the toilet. And then behind the door, which is kind of a tight fit, is the closet. Big tall garbage can, lots of catheters, lid that goes up and down, keeps everything in there that you want in there. Epsom salts, rubber gloves, wipes, Medical devices, baskets of stuff, wet wipes and extra, well, toilet paper, seashell because they're pretty, and a piece of the ceiling that needs to go in some ductwork. But then, Here, we have some more sneaky catheter storage. Urinals, rubber gloves, wet wipes, garbage bags, everything you need. So that's it for my bathroom, you guys. I do it super inexpensive and reversible when I don't own properties, I just rent. So 
These are the tips and tricks that I've used. I don't have a lot of medical devices. I realize I'm very fortunate. My head, my hands, we got full function up top. So I am able to grab things from upper shelves and move them around quite freely. I don't need a padded toilet seat. I'm pretty fortunate that I don't have pressure concerns with that. And it's just the tub bench, which I can remove by myself and in a different video show you how I can take it out and just have a regular bath completely independently. So thanks for watching everybody. Pro tips for Paris. My bathroom.